Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello everyone. Welcome to GFX Farhan. In this video, I will show you how to make colored smoke in Houdini. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so you never miss the new update. So before starting, let's see my final review. First of all, I add a geonode and here I add a file and import my Coca Cola can. Okay, this is my Coca Cola can. Okay, then I add a grid from here. Okay, and this is my camera. Now, this is my Coca Cola smoke setup. Okay, here I add a geo node, and uh, in this geo node, I add a tube if I show all and uh, show all in boost ok I add a tube change this to polygon this is my settings ok you can see this is my settings then I add a transform node and transform it little bit up then I add a pyro source node and uh, change change this to <coughs> volume scatter and this is my particle size this is my particle scale and here I add smoke source smoke okay density and temperature attributes are added ok density and temperature and also p scale particle scale then I add attribute noise node and this noise is on my position this is my setting amplitude 0 0.1 and element size 0 0.2 uh, add little bit expression on offset in the y direction and no animation here I don't add animation uh, noise animation because this is uh, added here something like this ok then <coughs> I uh, again add a noise attribute and uh, this time on density and density is float so I change it to float this is my settings range value to 0 center and uh, also by ramp if I show you then it's look like this ok element size 0 0.2 and now here I add animation noise ok on my density noise then I add a point velocity and in point velocity change it to set to set I change this set to value and default value to 1 and minus 1 ok add little bit coral noise this is my setting and that's it then I add a 
hide everything then i add volume rasterize node and in this volume rasterize node i add density and temperature and voxel size is connected with my pyro solver this is my setting clamp uh, coverage with density and this is my velocity okay here i add only velocity and you can see my setting here then i merge them both and then here i add my pyro solver node and connect this to my pyro solver this is my <coughs> collision setting i create something like this tube okay this is transform it transform it and uh, poly extrude and it looks something like this okay add a collision source node and uh, vdb stf reshape to combine both these and connect it to here okay now in pyro solver let me decrease it for the first result my will uh, time scale is 2 okay because i want first move up and uh, this is my max step to 2 and no advection reflection okay in bounds mm, nothing special only just i change my padding size to 0 0.5 because my smokes going fast and uh, it uh, cutting by this so by adding padding to 0 0.5 then there is a large gap in the smoke and in the container end and then it don't cut the smokes collision nothing special in sourcing okay in sourcing this is a default temperature is default velocity default and here i add a divergence field and divergence my in which uh, source volume is density because i want to apply divergence on my density field and target field to divergence and my scale is one and uh, okay this here i add custom velocity which is not necessary this is optional in okay now in uh, field tab this is my dissipation value okay flame life don't use flame life because we, i don't have any flame and i also check speed because it is necessary to use in disturbance field now in shape tab my buoyancy scale is 0 0.35 Uh, and uh, no wind if you are if you add wind then check it and add your own wind in the disturbance tab my disturbance value is 50 uh, block base block size 0 0.2 roughness 0 0.5 pulse length 0 0.25 and uh, this time my threshold field on density and uh, <coughs> this is my control field and for my smoke uh, for my smoke speed my control range is 1 and 5 okay and this is turbulence setting my turbulence setting is uh, 0 0.5 swirl size 1 
uh, roughness pulse and something like this control density control use control field by density and if I go inside <clears throat> this is my gas uh, vortex confinement okay confinement scale my time scale this is my gas disturbance okay this is my setting and this is gas disturbance this is my gas disturbance one and block size 0 0.1 and this is gas disturbance 2 and block size 0 0.05 okay and these are uh, connected with advection output here I add a file cache node and cache it to VDB okay but uh, unfortunately I deleted my cache so let me hide this and I will simulate it little bit okay so this is enough then I add uh, pyro bake volume and in pyro bake volume uh, my density is scaled to 50 and here I use red color and not use any other okay here I use red color now this is my red color smoke okay then I copy these both I select these both and copy one two and three times and uh, it because I need four okay and uh, for these three the setting is same setup is same let me show you only the setup is same only I change little bit setting in the noise noise attributes okay and that's it let me and if I simulate now all setting are same only I change little bit in the noise field and separate color for these okay simple setup camera environment light 
and uh, a highlight two lights that's it a very simple setup so thanks for watching see you in another video goodbye